All right, what up you guys? Cool, so uh, we got a question. And the question is, hey Lloyd, I see you in your approaching system, which is gonna be coming out uh, September 10th, uh, that you are talking to a lot of women on the sidewalk, beach, and in shops. Unfortunately, my area has a lot of things closed thanks to the lockdown and COVID. Uh, can you do a video where you talk about how to approach women in these environments where everything's uh, a lot of stuff is closed and shut down thank you so much okay cool so i get this question a lot um where especially now with the current state of affairs you know is it possible to walk up and talk to you know random women at a coffee shop grocery store you know on the street is it possible to start a conversation and have that potentially lead somewhere Absolutely, fucking lutely yes, okay? I mean, in the approaching system, I show you a video of me just walking on the beach for a couple hours, and literally I had seven girls back at my hotel room uh, later that night, okay? In fact, it actually made it easier in a certain way because all the bars and everything were closed. Like, that was during, that was, that was, that was exactly when the second lockdown hit LA, when they shut everything down for a second time. That's when I filmed all the infield for the approaching system. So yeah, it's absolutely possible you can do it. So there's tons of women out there that although maybe, you know, indoors or grocery store they might be wearing a mask, they're going to be open to meeting a guy. They're going to be open to talking to people. However, you don't know that 100% for sure. So what you should do is obviously start out from a place to make them feel safe. You know, six feet away. In fact, I would recommend you stand six feet away when you first start talking to a girl you don't know anyway. Um, the only difference is, is that, you know, sometimes you're wearing a mask, so sometimes I'll just take it down and I'll start talking to her, and if she kind of backs away like she didn't like that, then okay, I'll put my mask back up. No worries, no big deal. Okay, out of approaching, you know, 40 women on the beach and the sidewalk and all that stuff, I only had one woman tell me, hey, well, back away, stay six feet away. One out of 40, okay? So that should show you that it is definitely, definitely possible to walk up and talk to women. And you do a lot of the same things that you would normally do, like I said. But again, at first, stand six feet away, be respectful. And then if she is okay with, you know, you coming close, shaking hands and, and doing a high five or a hug or something like that, then do it. But always ask, okay? Remember, you're getting consent for, <laughs> I guess, you're getting consent to hug people now, uh, which is totally fine, okay? So um, do that, respect people's boundaries. Now, if you were on a date or if you were on something like that, um, I would say just kind of do the same thing. However, there's gonna be some women that you notice that are on the date that are you know, a little bit more worried than others, okay? Um, so in these circumstances, if you're hanging out with a girl you don't really know, maybe you matched on Tinder, you meet up, okay? You wanna stay very respectful at the beginning too. Uh, ask them what they're, what they're comfortable with. Is, is like, I would usually do a high five. Is like, you cool with a high five? Or you cool with a hug? Or an elbow bump? Or, or whatever it is. Okay, and if they're cool with it, then it's then it's fine. You know, usually um, I'd say most of the dates I've been on have, have been okay. Okay, however, sometimes you'll meet a girl where it's like she really is. Um, she's really scared uh, of all the stuff. So if you get someone like that, then you have to kind of <laughs> you basically want to like. Um, be not more worried about, but just as worried and very protective. So like I, I, I was out with a girl uh, a while ago. Um, she's super scared about the COVIDs. And so I basically was like, whoa, 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 whoa. We can't go in there. It's not safe. Or I was like, I was very like protective and making sure that she was, and she actually thought it was kind of funny. <laughs> okay. So the first time we hung out, that's what I did. And then, you know, the, the subsequent times after that, she was more comfortable with me um, because she kind of knew me and Sometimes it just takes a little bit of trust um, and that works. Now, obviously, if you meet somebody who says she's not going to be comfortable touching you or doing anything until somehow COVID disappears, um, you know, then uh, probably you should find another girl who is going to be willing to do that for you. Because um, I don't know about you, but it's very hard for me to date somebody standing six feet apart the entire time and having to wear masks. Um, this is not my speed. So there's plenty of women out there that are going to be able to do that. But if you meet somebody like that, I would, that's what I would recommend doing, you know, respecting their boundaries, being more <laughs> about it. Um, but yeah, you guys, I mean, this is definitely possible. I mean, just last week, I met a girl at a restaurant. She was right in front of me and we ended up hooking up that night. So like, you know, you can meet people out. It's very possible. Um, just respect people's boundaries. And you should do that anyway, whether or not there's um, whether or not there's something involved, uh, like a pandemic or whatever. Okay. That's my advice for you guys. Again, take this seriously. Be safe. You know, do uh, use your, be, be cautious and um, do what you feel like you need to do to, to keep yourself and your family safe.
Thanks a lot, you guys. And again, if you are wondering about the approaching system, um, I'm going to be coming out with that September 10th. There's going to be a link in the description box below if you want to get notified about it. Uh, but check back. This is the most comprehensive product. This is the uh, least, um, I put this at the most affordable price that I've ever put anything at in terms of services. So I'd highly recommend that if you want to learn how to do this sort of stuff, be able to walk up and talk to women and be able to, there's going to be a module on sexual escalation. There's going to be a module on a uh, on conversations, which is one of the things that I'm the best at. You know, I do demos with models and thing, infield footage and all that stuff. So all of that's going to be there. So thanks for watching, you guys. If you made it, consider subscribing. And good luck out there.